Hello, my name's Kut here, DJ, and today we're playing Claustrophobia, I believe that's pronounced. The Downward Struggle. Um, I haven't played this before. I've, um, I found it on uh, Steam Early Access. It looks very similar to uh, Dungeons of Dreadmoor, and I really love that game, so I thought I'd try this one out. Um, I, I do like the art style in it, it's very, very cool. Um, kind of cartoonish style um, artwork. Uh, so let's go to new game. So we get to create our character and class. So we'll just go with um, randomize. Pick a random one. Oh, that was fine. That one will do. And then we can just get, pick a class. And we can also edit the class as well. But I'm just going to pick a preset one. Um, so I'm going to go with Juggernaut. I always play tank anyway. So uh, randomize his name Baron Tasso. Tasso. Nope. <laughs> uh, that's a long one. Uh, Gimbom. Seems to say Gimbom. Gimbon. Looks like Gimbon. Yeah, Gimbon. Yeah, that suits. Yeah, we'll do that one. Let's start game. Okay, so basic tutorial. Left click, select your tile. Uh, right click to interact with the world. Nice and simple. Uh, all controls can be found in the key bindings. Thank you. And alternatively, you can use the keyboard. Okay, so we start off in a room like this, and we've got gold. 25 gold, that's not bad. Uh, a brown potion, unidentified potion, a mystery brown liquid bubbles is in the vial. Okay. Hmm, will we... I think we'll go through this door. Okay, nothing so far. Oh, some gold. Uh, what else we got? Well, we've got five doors to pick from here. Uh, let's just carry on going straight down, because we can always come back. Doesn't seem to be anything. Oh, hello. Shuffling corpse. Level 2 undead. 52 hit points. Oh. Right, let's take him down. Uh, what skills do we have? We have fortify. Enter a fortified state, causing all damage to be reduced by 46%. And we've also got swordmanship. Swing your sword wildly, shredding your, shredding your target. Shredding? Shredding. It's shredding. Say it properly. Shredding your target for 15 to 21 physical damage and causing them to bleed for 8 turns. That's pretty cool. Um, should probably use Fortify. Take less damage. Come on, hit him. There we go. Alright, he's missing us. We're not taking as much damage as before. Alright, that's one down. Another one moved up. And we've got a Dem Bones Archer. Level 1 undead. Okay. Okay, right, well, we're going to have to move out of the way here because he's going to keep shooting us, isn't he? Right, he can't. Skeleton doesn't seem to be able to hit from here, that's actually good. Let's use this skill on him. Perfect. Doing quite a bit of damage, but we have lost a, quite a bit of health. Um, let's have a look in our. Oh, Steam is being annoying. Go away, Steam. Thank you. Uh, inventory. Okay, so we've got a brown potion. Um, yeah, let's drink it. Okay, uh, we stores 2 MP. That's not helpful. Uh, I was hoping for health. Uh, the character sheet, that's not helpful. Okay, so we don't have anything to heal us. Alright, we're just going to have to fight this one. So we're going to use Fortify again. And hopefully... Okay, we didn't, didn't take too much damage that time. Let's go, get, let's go up there and get that gold. Right, so we're going to crate, smash it open. Nothing in it, great. Spike trap. Uh, Anything in the barrel? No. Okay. Anything in this pipe trap? Ah, it gives us XP for this armor, same as Dungeons of Dreadmoor. Okay. Uh, a locked door. No, no, we need a key. Okay. So we're gonna move. We're gonna go back and have a look. Let's go through this door. Uh, nothing in there. It's like a little closet. Another door. Oh, slimes. Squishly. Okay. A level one elemental. Um, let's send them come to us. Okay, these are nice and easy to kill. No issues. Okay, they're all dead. Tainted meat replenishes a small amount of hunger. Small amount of hunger. Turn skipped. Why am I skipping turns? Okay, you know what, there we go. Oh, it's because I'm pressing right, uh, left click, not right click. Okay, so I assume this is our hunger bar. 
Do we have hunger? Details. Um. Hmm. I assume if we have things that increase hunger, this will be our hunger bar. I wonder what happens if it runs out. Alright, so we've got some more gold. More gold. Oh, a sword. What's that? Uh, King Slicer. Uncommon sword for the main hand. 18 damage per turn. Ooh. Uh, what does our current one do? Oh, that's a definite improvement. We'll be having that. Thank you. Doesn't automatically equip, so we've got to go in here. And drag it over. Pop it in. Maybe? No, right click it. Why can't I equip this? Uh, you do not meet the requirements. Why don't I meet the requirements? Ah, I'm going to be level 3 or strength 8. Okay, that's fine. Uh, we're going here. More shuffling corpses. Oh, let's try and lure them out. There we go. It's the best tactic in these games. Lure them out. Bottleneck them. Take them out one by one. Alright. Oh, something shiny up there. Being guarded by another corpse. Alright, let's lure this one out. Right, fortify. Go on, do some damage. Alright, let's use this one. Nice. That fortify really does come in handy. Right. Boring leggings. Or leg plates. We can use them because we've got level... Level... Uh, yeah, level 6 strength. That's fine. Uh, so we can equip them. So, leg plates. Done. It's done, isn't it? Yeah, it's done. Sweet. That's up. Increased our armor. More gold. These locked doors. No. So, from what I read in this game, it's a um, procedurally generated roguelike um, level up. Uh, so yes, this is procedurally generated uh, dungeon crawlers, very very similar to Dungeons and Dreadmore. Um, but they do have their own style, and I've been poisoned. Hmm. So they do have their own style to it, which is good. Um, but I thought I quite like quite this game. It's good. You can't judge a game just because it's similar to another one. That's usually the. Oh. Shut the door in him. Alright. Let's go back this way. Have a look through here, perhaps. Another one of those. Oh, Dio Slam. Some more tainted meat. Another box ready to die. Uh, oh. Go back there. Alright, let's use that. Okay, I didn't really need to use that, did I? It's alright. Another sword we can't use. Pick it up anyway, because I know there's a shop in this game. And that was on the store page. Uh, hmm. Alright. I think that'll do it for today's episode. Um, now, hopefully this will be going up on uh, the Gamers Central community channel. Uh, which is a great channel. I advise you, if you're watching this, this video on that channel, please subscribe. That They do... They do some awesome stuff on their own channels as well. And they're really helping people by allowing other people to upload to this channel so they can get some exposure and hopefully grow. Um, so yeah, do check them out. They are some great guys. Um, yeah, this was uh, Claustrophobia. A downward struggle. I'm probably saying the name of it wrong. Uh, it's on Steam Early Access. Go check it out. Um, it does... To show some promise, I think, but I'll let you guys make your own choices. Thank you for watching. Uh, my channel link should be in the bottom near the, near the description. Thank you for watching. I've said that more than too many times. I will now go. Bye bye.